I'm really happy to be here today. Um, so I'm just going to dive right into Safari. Here we go. It's really great. And when you go to a website, you can really appreciate the new design. It's simpler and it's even more powerful. I can open up the sidebar really easily to get at my bookmarks, my reading list, as well as my um, shared links. And when I click into the search field, I get instant access to all my favorite sites. It's really nice. So I'm gonna go ahead and type in a search for Ansel Adams, there we go. And if I hit return, I could just go do a regular old Google search. But since Ansel Adams is a common search term, I get this new spotlight suggestion there at the top. It has a snippet of information from Wikipedia. I could read it there, or if I'd like, I could go ahead and see the entire article right on the Wikipedia site. It's super convenient. Now, if you use tabs, you're gonna love this. Now, no matter how many tabs I have open, I can smoothly scroll through them to get at any of that tab I'm looking for. It's really nice. So now, sometimes I wanna see my tabs, so I can go ahead and do this, and I'll click on the new tab view button, and there you go. A beautiful bird's eye view of all my open tabs. So I'm gonna go ahead and select this one here. It's a photo blog with a bunch of pictures of, of Yosemite, and there's a couple good ones of um, El Capitan down below. So I'll find them there, El Capitan. And then I'm gonna choose this one. Now I wanna share it with Craig, so I'm gonna get the high-res image. Now sharing couldn't be easier uh, in Safari. I just simply click on the share button here, and now I can use the new recent recipients feature to address it to Craig. And here we go. And just one click, I'm ready to send that image. It's that easy. So, but before I send it, I'm gonna add my two cents to this. So I can go here and we have just the right feature called markup. Now with markup, I can edit this image without ever even leaving mail. It's really great. So what I'm gonna do is um, annotate this image with a, a, a nice a magnifying glass, a loop. So as you move it around, you can see that it magnifies everything underneath it. So I'm gonna place it right here. And it turns out that those two specks on the big granite face there, they're actually climbers. It's kind of crazy. So I'm gonna zoom in a little more so you can see it better. There we go. So I can zoom nicely and place it here. Now, I wanna point this out to Craig in the mail. And I can use my trackpad to draw on the image. So I'm gonna go ahead and draw an arrow here. There we go. And you notice, Markup's smart enough to recognize the arrow and make it really pretty. So now, now it's really easy to add a, um, a comment. So check out the climbers. There we go. Now I can have a little fun with this. So I'm gonna go ahead and um, create a cartoon bubble. Okay, not so good at drawing, but markup's gonna help me. There we go. So luckily it can clean up, it's better than I am. So now I can add a caption. And so I think I'm gonna appeal to the inner developer in all of us. I'm gonna type in, I hope the rope is, wait for it, multi-threaded. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so I think I've done enough to this picture. Uh, time to go. <laughs> so um, now it's ready for me to mail, and I can just click like that. So that's how easy it is to mark up an image in mail. So those are a couple of great new features in Safari in mail. Thank you.